you see the green on the bottom of this front pupa? Right here. He's coming out of his chrysalis. Sorry, he's coming out of his skin and to his chrysalis. The skin is splitting. His head capsule has literally split open. And the new part underneath, the green part, is his new exoskeleton. Actually part of his body. That new green part, the new exoskeleton, will respirate just like it did when it was a caterpillar. It's still a breathing, very much alive creature. And this is why we don't call this a cocoon. A chrysalis is formed by molting the skin. This is also called a pupa. Chrysalis and pupa are the same words. They mean the same thing. It's just that a chrysalis is the pupa stage of a lepidopteran. That is going to be a butterfly. Moths usually make cocoons. When the skin gets to the very top, this little guy will wiggle around until he drops the skin. And then in a few hours it'll be hard like the ones you see in the background that are jade colored green. This one will look like that in just a few hours. Once its new skin hardens. So this is the pupa stage. All whole metabolic.